do you have a good life, but you know you want a great life? Like you want to go to the next level, but it's just something's holding you back, right? Like you know you want to go to that next level, but it's like you just kind of are stuck. You're plateaued. You just can't breathe through. Why is that? I want to share in today's video how successful people do this one thing without fail so that you can be able to break through and get to that next level. My name's Joe Moffitt with Master Life by Design and I'm excited to jump in. And before we jump in, I wanna give a couple shout outs. So I just wanted to give a shout out to two new subscribers, uh, Samar Tiger and Whitney Unkiefer. So I hope I said those right. If I didn't, please forgive me, but I just wanna give you guys a shout out. Thank you guys for subscribing. If you're not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button so that you can get updated three videos a week in areas of personal development. How do you better yourself? Relationships, how do you take your relationship to that next level? Or if there's speed bumps in it, how do we break free from that? Or if you're not in one, how do you get in one? And then business and finance, how do you be able to multiply your money, dominate that area? Because here at Master Life by Design, this whole entire channel, our entire business, my mission in life is to help people consciously create the life that they want. So life doesn't take control of you and the next thing you wake up, it's 10 years later, you're in your 30s, 40s, 50s, and you're like, where has my life been? We want to help you break through right now. And if you need help with that, go in the description below with the one-on-one personal development or should I say personal coaching and fill out that application and we'll get back to you and we'll get rolling. So anyway, let's jump into this video. What's the one thing that successful people do without fail? It's very simple. I've had this happen in my life all the time, at least in my early 20s. All I remember in my early 20s was, oh look, I just want to meet an incredible woman. I want to make a ton of money. I want to be rich and I want to do whatever I want. How many of you could relate to that? Maybe you've been there before, maybe that's you right now. You just wanna be rich, you wanna meet the love of your life, and you just want freedom, right? And that's great, but guess what? It never came. How many times have you been in a position where you're like, man, I just if I just can make more money this year, we would be able to get out of debt. Or maybe it's like, if I just found that one person, life would be amazing. There's a problem with that. The problem is that we are so general that you're never going to have success. See, successful people are never never general. The ones that are general are people who are unsuccessful. Well, thanks for telling me that, Joe. Well, what do you mean by this? What do you what do I need to do differently? The one thing successful people do without fail, from the thousands of people I've coached to tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands of people I've worked with around the world in group settings, is that what they do, what successful people actually do is they make sure before they do anything is they have maximum clarity. If you don't have clarity, everything is just kind of like a wish, it's a hope, it's a dream, and that's why you never hit it. If you're gonna make a change in your life, the very first thing you wanna do is get really laser specific on what you want. And you have to have that clarity because clarity is power. Now, here's what I'll say. <clears throat> when I'm working with clients and I'm explaining this principle of clarity, right? what I always like to say is if, let's just say you live in Florida or California, right? And I said, hey, let's meet up this weekend in Texas. Well, what's the first thing you would say? Well, most people, sometimes they ask, you know, well, what are we doing there? Why are we going? But once you're explained all that, and I said, go to the airport and buy a plane ticket to Texas. What are you gonna ask? You're gonna say, where in Texas? Because Texas is pretty big, it's a huge country. Ha ha ha, joke, joke, joke. All right, anyway. Um, so with that, Texas is pretty big, right? So does that mean Houston? Does that mean Austin, San Antonio? Like, where are we meeting? And even if I gave you a little deeper layer of clarity where I said, okay, I want you to meet in Houston or Austin. Well, you might sit there and say, you know what? That's great. Got to shut the computer off. That might be great, but where in Austin? Austin's huge. Does that mean that Lake Travis? Is it downtown? Is it at someone's restaurant or house outside the city? Like where in Austin? But if I said, let's meet on 6th Street, and I'm just going to make up a crossroad because it's not true, Market, 6th and Market, on the north end at 8.30 on Friday night, you now know exactly where to go, what time to be there, nothing 
outside of some challenges or tribulations that might come your way, because that's life, but you're going to know exactly where to go. You're not going to be so hesitant. The people who, because right, like if I say jump on a plane, you're going to be like, ah, uh, I'm sorry. I'm not just picking a random plane ticket to Texas. But if you didn't know I had $10 million cash I was giving you, you would never receive it. Right, because you'd be so hesitant. You would have the break on in your life moving forward. You'd have that break on so you wouldn't ever go to Texas. If you had clarity and I said Austin, Texas, 6th of Market, North End, 8.30 p.m. Friday, you know exactly how to get there and guess what? You're, without you knowing, you'd have $10 million cash in your bank or in your hand actually, right? <clears throat> so clarity is what successful people do before they do anything else. They have maximum clarity. So many times with clients, they say, I want more money. Okay, well, if you find a quarter on the ground, you just got your goal. And you're like, no, 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 I want 25 grand a month more. You have to be specific with it, right? You can't be so general, <coughs> excuse me. Or if you sit there and say, I want to meet someone that I can get married to. Look, you can get married to anyone literally anyone, as long as they're okay with it, right? But how do you know they are they have the right values or morals that align with you, the same vision or mission in life, lifestyle, spending habits? How do you know? So most people, what they do is they're so general in their approach, that's why they're so unsuccessful. Or something might happen where they get lucky and that's great, but they can't repeat it. See, I, I could repeat my success. All right, and I'm not trying to boast here. It's just like, I know what works and I know why it works, right? Like, I know why I found my wife. God forbid if anything ever happened to her, you know, I pray to God nothing ever does. But if something happened, I know eventually I could meet someone. And my wife too, she could do the same thing because she knows how she's created her success. How do I get back to the same financial level if we lost everything, which wouldn't happen, but if we did, how would I get back there? I know how to do that. Same thing for you is you need to know how you get to where you are or how you're going to get to the next level. You might have a good life, right? You might be making six figures, have a beautiful family, but you're out of shape and you want more money and you want more experiences. It's just you can and you just have this internal tug of war. When you get clarity, like successful people do, I want to blank. I want to get into, I want to get to 180 pounds of pure sexiness with 10% body fat. When you are absolutely clear like that, you now change the details of your habits and your actions, right? You get more dialed in into your nutrition and how many times a day you work out or how many times a week you work out and what kind of work you get laser focused in on those details. But if you just say, Hey, I want to get in shape. You might say, Oh, I'm not going to drink beer every night. I'm just going to have it on the weekend. That's cool, but the odds of you getting into the true desire shape you want, not gonna happen. I see it so many times with people, they, I just wanna make more money this year. They never make it, because they don't have a target. It's like, it's like if I was to put a blindfold on you, spin you around 20 times, give you a handgun, and say, there's a target out there, and if you hit it, you get $1 million cash right now. You can't see. You don't know where it is. The odds of you hitting it are extremely low. You probably have a better chance of getting struck by lightning or winning the lottery four times before you hit that target. So you need to get clear on what you want. The ones that are successful, the ones that I coach you, we are so clear. That's the first thing we do. So if I can help you today is you got to get clear on what you want. Go from being general, this high macro level down to the micro level. Now, one caveat, there is the thing of being too specific, too detailed, right? Like if you're sitting there and you're like, all right, I want a new home. You don't just say, oh, I just want a new home. No, you got to get really specific, but you don't want to go too specific. Like to the, you know, the end of that point, you don't want to go there either where you're like, okay, the bathroom's got to be a 10 by 10 bathroom with tile to up to eight feet in the bathroom with this color lighting and you're just gonna go crazy, right? There's a level, there's that middle ground where you're like, look, I want a, I want an acre lot with a five bedroom, four bath home. I want 3,800 square feet or more with a two car garage, right? That level of specificity 
is so important. But if you get too micro, it's just irrelevant, right? Like you're almost making it impossible to hit your goal at that point. So if you wanna be successful, if you want your life to go from good to great, the first thing you gotta do is have clarity, stop being so general, get detailed and specific, not too specific and detailed, but just that happy medium for you. And I promise you, your relationship can change, your finances can change, your body can change, your career can change. Stop settling for good when you deserve great and that all that comes with is clarity because most of us, when you know exactly the target, you go right there, right? But if you don't know where the target is, we're a little hesitant. We put the brake on. Don't let that be you, right? And so if you're gonna go to that next level, sometimes we need someone to help us get there, right? Because they say, if you want to go far or if you wanna get somewhere fast, go alone. If you want to get somewhere farther, go with someone. Well, some of us, we're, we're living a good life, but we deserve great. You know you do. And I don't have to tell you, my words speaking to you, your heart just resonating, your gut kind of like, Ugh, you're right. And if that's you, you may want to work with a coach, a professional coach. And here at Master Life by Design, we have some incredible coaches that can support you, or myself or my wife. So fill out that application down below on the one-on-one -on -one coaching so we can help you break through. Look, money comes and goes, but time you can never get back, right? And you pay for coaching the full time. And I always say, anything great is not cheap, but it's always worth it, right? I, had a, I used to have a Honda and it was a good car, but I remember my buddy, he got a brand new uh, Mercedes and that was a way more expensive car, but it was way better and I fell in love. And then eventually I got clear on what kind of Mercedes I wanted and I leased one out. No, I didn't buy it. It didn't make sense to buy. I don't, I don't understand unless you have a vision for the long term and finances make sense and you're at an economic level. We'll go into all that in another video, but hey, fill out that application below. If you guys found value, please give it a thumbs up. Also comment below, would love to hear your thoughts, what you think, what do you need to get clarity on? What does that look like? I'd love to give you feedback, some one-on-one -on -one coaching, I guess you could say, through the comments here in this video. And then most importantly, hit that subscribe button. We're coming out with three videos a week, like I said, or more, we, are, we might be doing some live streams for you guys and interviews and all. So make sure you hit that subscribe button, but go out, get the clarity you need in the areas where you're most challenged, and I promise you, life will go in an entirely different direction. Watch you full time. So with that, my name is Joe Mavu, Master Life by Design. Have a great one. See ya.